Hello everyone, this is Pragya Pandey from Rouse Academy for Competitive Exams Bhopal and this is our special series on daily news review. In our previous video, I asked few questions and solution for them are as follows. So the first question was, all minorities, whether based on religion or language, shall have the right to establish and administer educational institution of their own choice, given under which article? And the correct answer for this question is Article 30. What is zombie eyes? The correct answer for this question is eyes that is still a part of the parent eye sheet but is not gaining new snow. So let's move further and see what is in the news. Countries in Middle East and North Africa are racing to develop chemicals to get raindrop out of the cloud. Whereas cloud seeding is a type of weather modification that aims to change the amount or type of precipitation that falls from clouds by dispersing substances such as silver iodide, potassium iodide, dry ice, and liquid propane into the air that serves as cloud condensation or ice nuclei. There are certain benefits like it improves a cloud's ability to produce rain or snow, supplements the rainwater supply, and cleans the atmosphere by introducing tiny ice nuclei into certain type of sub-freezing clouds. These nuclei provide a base for the snowflakes to form. As of now, experts have not found any harmful effect of cloud seeding with silver iodide on the environment, but silver iodide can be toxic to aquatic life. In context of India, the cloud seeding operations were conducted during the year 1983, 1984, 87, 1993, 1994 by Tamil Nadu government due to severe drought. In the year 2003 and 2004, Karnataka government also initiated the cloud seeding. Government launches integrated pharmaceutical database management system 2.0 and Pharma Sahidam application 2.0 that is developed by National Pharmaceutical Pricing Authority. Let's understand these one by one. IPDMS 2.0 is an integrated responsive cloud-based application that is developed by NPPA with technical support from the Center for Advanced Computing. It is envisaged to optimize synergies and operation to promote government thrust on ease of doing business, as it would provide a single window for submission of various forms as mandate under the Drug Price Control Order 2013. Pharma Sahidam App 2.0 will have Update features like speech recognition, availability in Hindi and English, a share button, and bookmarking medicines. This version of Pharma Sahidam also has a facility for launching complaints by the consumer through the consumer complaint handling module. The app will be available in both iOS and Android version. Indian Railways will set up Meghdoot machine at Mumbai station, which uses innovative technology to convert water vapor in the air into potable water. India joins the elite club of nations having indigenously built quantum communication technology for armed force. The Innovation for Defense Excellence, Defense Innovation Organization, the QNU Labs, a Bangalore-based deep tech startup, developed this system of advanced secured communication through quantum key distribution system. The quantum key distribution system allowed creation of a quantum secure secret pair of symmetric keys between two endpoints separated by certain distance, in this case over 150 kilometers, in terrestrial optical fiber infrastructure. The quantum key distribution helps create a non-hackable quantum channel for creating unhackable encryption keys, which are used to encrypt critical data, voice, video across the endpoints. Delhi government launched the first of its kind Delhi model virtual school. Any student from India can apply on the website that is www.dmvs.ec.in and get enrolled. The platform will also provide the student access to a huge digital library and the content will be round the clock. Apart from regular online classes, students will also be provided coaching for competitive exams such as JEE and NEET in class 11th and 12th. This initiative will be one step closer to bringing education accessible to all and achieving sustainable development goal for quality education. UGC to launch e-Samadhan portal to address the grievance of a student. 
UGC has also set definite timelines for addressing the grievances. For student-related matters, the deadline has been fixed at 10 working days. For teaching and non-teaching issues, the issue needs to be addressed within 15 days. And for any matter related to the university or college, a maximum time limit of 20 days is allowed. The Department of Biotechnology announced the scientific completion of India's first indigenous made quadrivalent human papilloma virus vaccine against cervical cancer. When cancer starts in the cervix, it is called cervical cancer. According to the Center for Disease Control and Prevention, all women are at risk for cervical cancer. It occurs most often in women over age 30. Long-lasting infection with certain types of human papilloma virus is the main cause of cervical cancer. When cervical cancer is found early, it is highly treatable and associated with long survival and good quality of life. The HPV vaccine protects against the type of HPV that most often causes cervical, vaginal, and vulvar cancer. India has been fully dependent on foreign manufacturers for the HPV vaccine. However, on September 1st, India is getting its first indigenously developed quadrivalent human papilloma virus vaccine. So it's a quiz time. And the question for today is, cloud seeding is an artificial way to induce moisture in the clouds through chemicals so as to cause a rainfall which of the following chemicals are dumped onto the clouds to bring rain shower your options are silver iodide dry ice potassium iodide and liquid propane the second question is e samadhan online portal is launched for the redressal of grievance to whom i'll be providing answers for these questions in upcoming videos so this is it for today join our batches for upsc mppsc civil services examination seats are very limited so hurry up thank you for watching this video do not forget to hit like button and comment your valuable feedback also press the subscribe button and please follow us on instagram and facebook links are given below in the description box thank you and see you tomorrow